All right, people, here we go. Um, so talk more about anime and well, me playing Transformers. Oh, great, I hate this map. It's so enclosed. Wait, what? It's so, it's so enclosed, like the in... Oh, enclosed. Yeah. I said, I, I heard a G in there, enclosed. No, my bad. Anyway, <laughs> yeah, like, okay. back to what Jan was discussing about anime. I, 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 after this, I, I feel like my opinion will kind of change with when it comes to anime at least to feeling indifferent to feeling hatred, which one's the the best out of the two. Right. And I kind of my, my original thing was between indifferent and yeah. ang and anger. Okay. Yeah, came let, from let, it came let, from originally from Mass Effect. I can actually. hear you. Really? Yeah. It came from. Just if you guys don't know Mass Effect One, the first game. What's Mass Effect? What? The, it's a space game. Yeah, sp a sci-fi space game. Really good game. At one point... Does it have Mario in it? What the hell are you doing? <laughs> Just kidding, go ahead. At one point in the in the game, you have two of your teammates, and you have to leave one to die. Okay. And they're going to be dead throughout the whole game. Right. Even, and it, oh, damn it. Rough start. <laughs> <laughs> it built the conversation to yeah. end that. And, pretty much, and, I, and one was a... And basically, yeah, my... And I chose one person... One person was a guy named Caden, and he just bored me. He wasn't interesting at all. He was just a boring character to right, me. Right, right, right. The other character was Ashley. That now, you, I'm assuming you hated. I wouldn't say hate, but you didn't like. I didn't like that much. Oh well, that one's a little different. Yeah. Because the and, the, the, the intensity oh, of your your dislike is yeah. slightly different. I I didn't like her because she was kind of racist towards the alien my alien crew. Okay. Yeah. So in deciding, I chose Ashley. Okay. Because at least with her, it invokes some kind of emotion. With Caden, I was just bored with. I wouldn't want him in my team. Mm -hmm. Because, you know, he's going to be your teammate. He's going to be your ally. But he was just boring to me. His story was boring. They, they have their own separate stories, but he was just like a guy who I really did not care about. Mm -hmm. So that's why I kind of went for Ashley. Yeah. Because that, that's where my original hate, hate versus indifference okay. came from. And if I were to elaborate on this, uh, this just... For one, this conversation, what has made me realize holy shit that that close. I think it just comes down to how you approach entertainment are you the type of person who just like I'm, it's all about just what I like and dislike because if it's that just that you're right that's completely right why should you go with something you don't like? but if we're if we're going in from a reviewer point of view which we are by definition we have our main channel media shinobi uh. no shameless plug-in by the way <laughs> Uh, when we're as a reviewer, not only are we reviewing it just because whether we like it or not, we have to understand that this also this video will serve for other people. Mm -hmm. That they're gonna have to we're gonna have to be as objective as possible so that they could get something away from this video. They're like, oh, they didn't like it, but they did say it's more for me. Wow, they were really right. See, that that's the whole point, and that's what, in my opinion, makes a good anime. Because just because I didn't like it doesn't. Because it's like one of those situations where you're in the majority versus the minority. Right. Just because you're in the minority doesn't mean you're wrong. Right. And just because you're in the majority doesn't mean you're Kinda right. Kind of like how I feel about Cowboy Bebop. Yeah, like, personally, um, I think it, it, it boils down to what I, I said earlier. It's just like, in terms of like and dislike, you have every right to say that. Mm -hmm. But um, right, remember right. that the intentions of Cowboy Bebop technically was to be episodic. Yeah. So... Yeah. So long as you acknowledge that, yeah. I, didn't that's all, that it's all good. I didn't expect that. Oh well, see, going that, in, I didn't expect. Um, it just to give you guys a heads up for anyone who doesn't watch as much anime as like we do, collectively as a group, um, space westerns tend to be episodic. Right. They very episodic, especially if it, if it has the word western, episodic. The reason why is because western animes don't have an overarching plot tent, most of the time. I mean, they, there is somewhere there, but barely. It's always about – westerns are always about the journey. It's like the Chuck Norris TV shows back in the old days. It was always episodic. It was all of just about like what happened in that one episode and that one episode alone. So I understand where Chris is coming from point of view. Like I get it. If we're talking about anime, like, dislike, he got it down. He got it down. But um, I'm trying to say like the, the argument I was saying earlier was more on – the fact of what makes it good. Now, obviously, at the end of the day, we're all subjective. Right. There is no such thing as pure objectiveness. Like, no matter how much like, reviewers or those high officials claim for this to be, you know, critically acclaimed, it's subjective. And, yes. ah, you son of a bitch. But the purpose of what they're trying to do is to be as least 
subjective as possible. And that's what we strive. It's one of those things. It's like there's a metaphor in, in the. I'm so sorry. Everyone. Sorry, I had an epiphany, and that's my metaphor. But um, there's a metaphor in the science field where there are there are a few scientists. I think actually Bleach mentioned this in one of the anime uh, the anime episodes. I'm not too sure, or maybe the manga. But scientists don't want to achieve perfection. Just say, like, I, since I'm on my break, whenever, but... Okay, I'm sorry, people. That was a phone call, but hold, continue. Hold, hold on, I'm just kidding now. But, uh, what? Oh, God, I sucked too much. What was I going to Subjective. Say? A little bit further than that. Oh, there was an analogy. Scientists, there are a few scientists who are super ambitious and truly love what they do that they don't want perfection. They don't want perfection? Because their job is ended. Right, right, I see where they're going with that. Yeah. So they don't want to reach absolute perfection because that... There's nowhere to go. There's no more goal. There's no more... It Life is meaningless now. Yeah. You have the answer. You're done. Yeah. So to, to correlate that back to anime, if it was all objective, there's no point anymore. That's not entertainment. Yeah. So that's why there has to be... There's this, this very fine but almost... We don't know where to draw the line of what is the perfect balance. Wow, that is unfair. My team sucks. I was wondering why I keep dying. Sorry for interrupting. 24 yeah. to 3? No, for real. I, I'm number one. Okay, I'm sorry, people, but my team sucks. Sorry for interrupting. But no, I'm baffled. Just like I'm baffled, you. too. But, uh... Oh, yeah. There's, like, this fine line that we just don't know where to draw in terms of the balance between objective and subject. Yeah, it's really because hard, especially for the, reviewers. Because for us right now, if I were to describe how I see us right now, you versus me, you're more subjective for the right reasons versus me being more objective for the right reasons as well. So, in a sense, it's great that we are a group channel because it gives a good balance. While Scott is, like, almost... He's the indifferent... And he calls it how it is. He'll like it or dislike it. Right. That's that's about it. So we all are different on how we approach things. And I think that's what I like about Media Shinobi. Yeah. As a group. Because there is a lot of variety in how we feel. Because about if we can't find a fine line, we'll just do it by numbers. And we have three people with completely different points of views. Yeah. Coming together and talking about anime. Or whatever it is that we're doing, whether it's movies, television shows. Again, no shameless plug-in. <laughs> But, uh, yeah, that's why it's, like, it's really, it's all subjective at the end of the day. Yeah, that's true. It just really is. But, yeah, uh, going back to the original, original one where... What was the original? Naruto. original? It, it, we're, we're so deep in yeah. that I don't remember. Yeah, and, again, I feel like my indifference came from the, came to me recently where... Due to frustration and exhaustion. Yes, because... I just became indifferent just because it just, like, it just happened. It just happened? It just happened, like, I, it was, it was basically the Toby one. That was literally the last chapter. Wait, when he shows he's actually Toby? Like, the, I, without spoiling... <laughs> well, I'm not going to say who Toby is. Everyone should know who Toby is. The episode came out. Some people... Like, yeah, I know. What, people who only watch the English dub? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but... <laughs> <laughs> like, oh, you are in for a surprise. <laughs> but no, like... It's Obito. There. Did it. Okay, Very okay that just happened. <laughs> okay, but... For the most point, I think after that, I just... I think... I, I, I didn't break... But something happened. Yes. Something happened. With was it because me. of Obi Dill being? No, it was just like. Really? Really? Because, no lie, we all did, at eventually one point considered. <laughs> yes, but um, we all we all we, we, we all agree right. We that's all, too easy. It was too easy. That's too convenient. Yeah. Like, and anyone who says it's because of the hair, uh, you know what? Whatever. <laughs> and I feel like it could have been better if. I liked Vince's theory better. What was the theory? Something about the, sec the, the sun, the, the first sun, sun the of sun, the sage yeah. or something like that. Yeah. I thought that was way more complicated, Yeah, I think, intricate. I think some really good theories out there. And I was like, come on. I, no, I feel it. like the execution was also not good. Oh, I don't know. So I, It's been a while since. Basically, you know, um, funny. his mode was so always considered to be Rin. Like, that's yeah, kind of the reason why he's doing this. And they, Kishi, I do not know why, but. Get over funny. <laughs> he, he plays it off as com yeah, comedic yeah, when exactly the romance I, when they were still young. Oh, exactly. yeah, you told me about Yeah, and I told this Jan to Jan. That was not comedic. I'm, I never found I'm, any of the uh, romance funny when it comes to Obito and Rin. It was borderline, if not obsession. So, some, 
something that you have ever